the main reason we're here is just to infuse. We're so lucky to do something we really love for our living. And we would love everyone in the room to have that experience. It's always lovely, you know, coming and meeting young people. When I've seen people that I look up to and respect tell me that, yeah, I struggle with this, this is difficult, suddenly it's like, oh, great, I'm the same, we're the same. This is the space, if you like, where those people can look and find the thing that they're good at, and that thing could very well be the next thing that everyone is going, wow, that's amazing. This time you have now, doing this for a living and having to earn money, it's actually harder to practise. So you have three years now where you have this freedom. For me personally, those the three years I was at music college, I, I feel really set me up. Other things we covered in today's workshop were other techniques that you can use to practice using this idea of a triangle with harmony, rhythm and melody, where you might like to try different ones at the top so you're focused more on rhythm for a little while and melody and harmony are of course always there as supporting elements in this triangle but you've got rhythm at the top. Does anyone want to come and play something? <laughs> When the guys who come in get us to go on stage and play, that's when you learn the most. The workshop was great. It was uh, really interesting for me as a drummer to go to a, a workshop of, as a duet and I can see that side of how people play. Really the, the underlying thing of the workshop is I want everyone to realise that we're in the same boat. The only difference is that we've been doing it longer so we may have learned some things that people haven't yet learnt. Yeah, I found the workshop really good, really useful. Came out and practiced everything they told me to do. The more you go to these workshops as a developing student, the more confidence you have to ask the right kind of question. I thought the workshop was really insightful. Lots of great comments on how to practice. Lots of things that I think, actually, that's a really great insight. I'm going to take that and use that for my own practice routine. And they'll realise, oh, that's all it ever is. It just, this is fun. <laughs> Make it a journey with heart. If there's that kind of umbilical cord to that passion that first started you out and made you fall in love with this music. That will be your guiding force because that's really the only reason to make music in the end. So that may as well remain your, your guiding force.